Some news for topic number two today. The Big Ten and the SEC are discussing a strategic alliance, which would direct them toward a result here where both conferences schedule in such a way that they both receive four automatic bids for the college football playoff. 12-team playoff, we're already in year one, going to be in year two very soon. We're already seeing conferences try and manipulate their way to commandeering the matchups in the playoff. Your thoughts? One, uh, my first thoughts are that you should be on some type of Big Ten board because you would be incredible at just midseason negotiations and ideas like this. Like this would be a you idea. Like you call me and be like, hey, what do you what do you think if I say the word alliance? And you would just you would you would really facilitate those type of conversations. Um, I think given. I, I don't know. The only thing that doesn't sit right for me is that four number, because once you get to the fourth team in these conferences, are you feeling good about those teams being automatic bids of college football playoffs? No. Like three. Yeah. Four. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. This is a classic case of them getting greedy, which I honestly have to respect, because this is something you and I do all the time. We get greedy. When something good happens, we will literally text each other and be like, can I get greedy for a second? This is what they're doing. If you go in and research what's happened here. So the the SEC and the Big Ten have had these conversations for forever. They were a part of the meetings to get to the point of a 12-team playoff, right? Uh, They were pushing for a 14-team playoff already. Like the moment they got a 12-team playoff across the finish line, the SEC and the Big Ten were like, we want 14 teams in the playoff. They're not going to stop there. They're going to want 16. Then they're going to want 20. It's just going to keep going until we're like, let's just make it a full March Madness-style football tournament. Um, The initial thing that the SEC and Big Ten countered for was a model that goes 3-3-2-2-1, meaning the SEC and Big Ten would get three teams in, and then presumably the Big 12 and the ACC would get two teams in, and then there would be one more team from an additional conference. Um, That's interesting because they've immediately flipped from that into, no, we want four. Like, you could very easily get that sort of system approved, I feel like. And instead, it's like, no, we want four. We're, we're coming together for four. We're meeting in Nashville this weekend to talk about how we need more teams in the playoff. I, I'm very confused on it all. Like, how does this even work? Do the SEC and Big Ten just get to make a phone call and be like, we want more teams in the playoff? And then the NCAA is like, okay, sure, cool. I, I don't understand it at all, but... This is definitely where the sport's headed, right? It's like one huge super conference that just supplies all of the playoff teams. Yeah, I mean, this is like the idea of the NCAA, because it's not just football, it's basketball, it's everything. They don't want to let like the super conference thing die. Even if they got to slow play it and do little things like this along the ways for it eventually to end up like super conferences. And honestly, maybe it does. Uh, Maybe I'm just being naive thinking that it won't end up like that. But this is just like maybe a quick fix way to try to get to a point where we're at the super conferences and it's super greedy and I'm not with it, even though I'm pro greed. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I, I mean, I, I don't know. Can you be pro greed and also not love the move? No. Yeah. No, I feel like you got to decide one way or the other, because I mean, right now you're looking at, look at the, the the two conferences. Who is that fourth team? That would be the automatic bid. I know it's early in the season, but like, I think the big 10 has four teams worth it this year. And the sec definitely does. Like they're probably going to get four anyway. Right. Like unless the flip would be the sec gets like five and the big 10 gets three, which honestly would be kind of fun. Because if I know one thing about alliances from my years of watching the challenge in Survivor is that the important moment for alliances is when the alliance eats each other near the end game. And I feel like that's going to come here at some point. Like, yeah, of course, this is the first year of the playoff. It's week five. Sure, we both just want four. Let's make it an even split. But then you get to week 12 and the SEC has like Ole Miss and Georgia as their fourth and fifth best teams and the big tens fourth team is Michigan and the sec is going to flip and call the NCAA so fast and be like, we deserve five. And then the big Ten's going to be duped, you know? I kind of like that idea, but I would have to one, 
I'm feeling good about where I'm at conference wise coming off paternity leave. I think I know I got realignment down and I know which teams are where now. And with that said, the SEC would get somewhat slighted in this, but I don't know. I, I know you're saying four Big Ten teams are deserving. I don't know if I would I would say that right now. Uh, I mean, I think it would, and what and wouldn't this kill like because this would uh, whether they mean it or not, this would kill like a a Boise State or UNLV getting in, right? No, there's a guaranteed 12th team that gets in from a non. Power oh, group. okay. So there still would be that guarantee. That this just hurt. Team. This hurts the ACC Big Twelve. I'm okay. I kind of like this. Then I'm fine with it hurting the ACC. It would be a fourth Big Ten team over like a second team from the Big Twelve, which right now seems reasonable. But that does seem reasonable. Even the ACC, it seems reasonable. All I know is if I'm if we're all in a big game of Survivor, the moment I hear this, I'm sliding in and asking the Big Ten to go get some wood with me. And then on the walk to the wood, I'm hitting them with a, yeah, you know, the SEC probably thinks they deserve five or six teams in, huh? Huh? This, this is why I'm saying you should be in this. You should, you should be perfect. 